Yo! Damn it, I just fixed this thing. It's making squeaking sounds again. Huh? Yeah. Hey, by the way, I'm sorry about the other day. You know, about what I said to Nanako-chan. After hanging out with Nanako-chan, I feel even stronger that we have to solve this case. Same to you. You know, Chie and Yukiko seem different lately. They're a lot closer. Oh, yeah, I was just curious, but are you... I, never mind. You know, if we keep chatting, we're gonna be late. Oh, man, school's such a chore. And now my bike's messed up, too. The roads are much wider here than in the city, so I keep speeding. I guess that did it. <sighs> oh, well. Until I get my motorcycle license, I'll just have to walk. What's up? Why do the holidays have to end so fast? And at least they were peaceful. I listened in on the housewives gossiping at Juness, but it doesn't seem like anything happened. And I haven't heard anything about someone disappearing suddenly either. You think Yukiko could have been the last of the victims? Hmm. I don't know, but we shouldn't relax as long as the culprit remains at large. I wonder, will someone show up on TV again if it rains? We only knew a little more about who the killer might be. Eh, it's no good fretting over it now. If someone does show up on the Midnight Channel, then we'll deal with it. It's supposed to start raining soon, but I hope this weather holds through next week. You know, midterms. Ah, uh, you had to go and bring that up. I don't want to think about it. <sighs> I wish I had Yukiko's gift for studying. Hey, Yosuke! Why don't you have Yukiko go over some of the material with you? Hmm? Oh, that's right. Yukiko's ranked at the top on every exam. Maybe I should ask her for some private lessons. Uh, for private lessons? Huh? What's wrong? Ow! What was that for? I'm just asking you to help me study. Oh, I'm sorry. You were talking about studying. I thought it might have been an off-color joke. Arian has had some strange visitors lately. If you thought it was a joke, then just shrug it off. Sorry, my hand moved without thinking. Jeez. Thanks a lot, Chie, for bringing up the whole studying thing. Wh what did I do? Uh, you're the one who made it sound creepy and wrong. Private lessons, huh? What? Then it's mostly my fault? Oh, I should start heading home.
You're back. Well... Hey, Chie, I bought you a new copy of that Trial of the Dragon flick. It was the greatest punches version for 980 yen. If I knew then, I'd just replaced it instead of buying you grilled steak. This is clearly getting closer. Huh? What are you, scared of a little lightning? Quiet, you! I'd be a goner if even one of those things hit me. Ah! <laughs> You're freaking out way too much. Come on, shouldn't weather like this help with your kung fu training? A bolt of lightning would hit and it'd give you the inspiration for a new move. There was a scene like that in your DVD, wasn't there? You jerk! You don't even care how I feel! If lightning has to strike someone, let it be this guy! <laughs> huh? Is this a blackout? That's what you get for saying that stuff, Chie. Looks like I better hurry up and head to work. Depending on how produce sells today, I might get a little bonus in my pay for the week. This weather may keep customers away, but I gotta do my best if I'm gonna save up for a motorcycle. It's from my manager. Hello? Uh, Yosuke-kun? Hmm. Uh, some of the power in the store is out after that lightning strike. 
Good to come in early today. All the refrigerated shelves have stopped running. It's looking like we'll have to close up the produce section early today. Wait, what? But my pay... Anyway, I need you here to help deal with this mess. I'm counting on you. Goodbye. Wait. What are you looking at me for? Uh, why did this have to happen? Hey, Yukiko, can we just go home? Chie, do you know this story? A girl forgot her homework, so she snuck into school in the middle of the night, but she suddenly needed to use the bathroom. She ventured into the girls' room where all the lights were off. No one should have been there, but in the mirror... Hold it right there! What are you talking about? Huh? It's a ghost story. I thought you liked them. Yeah, but why tell it now? Thanks. I'm glad you're here. <sighs> Why don't you just have him escort you back home, Chie? Uh, are you making fun of me? Well, yeah, with how freaked out you are, can you blame me? Oh, the power's back! Come on, Yukiko, let's go home!
made flowers at school yesterday. They said today is Mother's Day. My teacher told us that's a day when you give your mom flowers. I don't have a mom, so I don't know what to do with these flowers. Huh? But it's Mother's Day. Is it okay to give them to Dad? Okay, then I'll give them to him. Um, I did a really good job. My teacher said they were pretty. <laughs> I wonder if Dad will be happy to get them. You should make a flower too, big bro. Then we can celebrate Mother's Day together. We did it! Testing, testing. There we go. Oh, wow. Jesus. Hello? Did, did. Oh, God. Please don't tell me I crashed. Oh, God. Really? Oh, oh. We got it. We got it. Okay, cool. Alright, we got it. We're back. We're back. Okay, cool. Shut up. Shut up. I'm taking my midterms. <laughs> don't talk about trauma right now with Nadako and shit. Just, just don't. These types of numbers does not exist. It's uh, marriage numbers. <laughs> Translated, I love you as the moon is beautiful. I don't remember which one. 
Not really, you're here, ho. What the fuck you mean? <laughs> what are we talking about? I I am busy taking my exams right now, okay? Gosh. I'm, be I'm busy peeking my microphone, apparently. Jesus. Oh my gosh. I don't remember this one. I, I, I believe it's not to me. Yeah, let's go with that. Ugh. I feel icky. Midterms, day three. Who said as soon as laws are necessary for men, they are no longer fit for freedom? I have no fucking clue. Uh, that one. I don't feel right about that. Which of the following is the highest mountain in the solar system? That's not Mount Everest. That's, uh... Maxwell Montes, because Maxwell Montes is on Mars. Or is it Gulamans? No, it's gotta be Maxwell Montes. Don't have a good feeling about your answer. What the? Okay, cool. I guess I answered that one wrong. Last question gave you a hard time feel you did well okay cool thanks but thanks game okay it's finally over all right so fucking <laughs> didn't even notice that my mic was off this entire time so yeah um <sighs> I mean, you guys didn't really miss much of anything other than, oh, hey, look, uh, fucking, you know, lobster fighting bad guys, and then a uh, big bad guy said, he gave me a bitch slap and said no more, and, uh, it's just, uh, yeah, um, owie, um, uh, <laughs> I'm liking I am more and more uh, uh, warming up to Chie. Um, I feel like we wa got off on the bad start with Chie, but like Chie is 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 not my home girl. You know, I <laughs> oh man, she reminds me of someone, but you know we we don't talk about that anyway. We're gonna keep on going here. Ooh, what a load off. I bet every student feels like this after exams are over. Hey, quiet down! So what did you write for number seven? The one about what that referred to in the sentence? Um, I put her sorrowful expression. Oh crap, then I got it wrong! I put the rice cakes on top of the table! <laughs> rice cakes? Wait, was that what the story was about? All right. I'm giving up on composition. I'm gonna bet it all on geography. What did you choose for the tallest mountain in the solar system? Uh, I put Mount Maxwell, but it's not Mount Maxwell. It's Olympus Mons. Ah, seriously? I chose the wrong one. Oh, I put that one too. Whoa, you two? That's probably the right answer. Boy, I can't wait for our grades to be posted out in the hall where everyone can see them. Jeez. Hey, did you hear? A TV station's filming here in town. They're probably just doing more stuff about that hanging corpse case. No, it's not that. You know the highway nearby? They're gonna cover those biker gangs that hang around there. A friend of mine goes to the biker meeting sometimes. I heard it from him. Dude. What are you doing hanging out with a guy in a biker gang? Well, anyways, what do you think about tomorrow's group blind date? We were gonna meet outside, but it's gonna rain soon, right? Won't it be better to play it safe tomorrow, too? Biker gang? Oh, yeah. They raise a ruckus from time to time. I guess your place is too far away to hear them. We live right by the road. The noise can drive you insane. 
I hear some guys at this school are part of it, too. Yeah, I know there are some rumors about a first-year student here who's a total hellraiser. One of the guys working at Jeunesse said the dude's been a legend ever since middle school. Although, was he in a biker gang? Did... did you say he was a legend? Uh, it's not what you think, Yukiko. Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, you know, don't, <laughs> don't fucking talk to me when you're fucking driving. Stop it. Uh, reminds you of some, what, what, what do you mean? Chie is the best, is the best. You're my car radio right now. What the fuck? Dude, come on. Anyway, hey Chie. Isn't ready to advance yet. See you later. No, I don't want you to be sad. God damn it! No, I want. To... Cause you're normally around in the evenings, so that way I can, you know, make a bond stronger, and then I can make more bonds with other people. I did. Hey, made it. I'm sorry. Uh, okay. Wait, no, wait. Oh, right. They're all downstairs. Okay. All right. Uh, all right. Also, uh, so, uh, this guy's a, this girl's a bitch. That's what I'm thinking so far. So, uh, goodbye. Um, I love these guys' dynamic right here, but I also love Yasuke. Ah, fuck it. I'm Yo. farther along with these guys. Oh, it, uh -huh. it. oh, that's right. We practice on Thursdays. Okay. All right. Everyone, good news, boys. You're getting a team manager. Now you guys won't have to take turns doing all the work anymore. You can thank me later. Go on, introduce yourself. I, Ebihara. Okay, random voice. Yep. <laughs> Jesus. Great, you can take it from here. I'm going home. Jesus, fuck. What? I'm gonna tell you guys straight up, I'm not lifting a finger for this team. Oh, damn. <laughs> I wouldn't be caught dead watching out for a bunch of sweaty guys. What? Then why did you... I've missed too many days of school, but they'll let me move up if I manage a team. But don't expect me to put any effort into it. For the most part, I'm not even gonna be here. Goodbye. Well, see ya. Or not. What was that all about? Oh well, I guess I said we'll be doing our laundry, huh? Why are you showing her so much respect? She's the same age as us. Dude, just let me fantasize about her in peace, alright? No way, her? Soccer players, be continue talking about I Abby and Ira. Oh my god. Uh, that's, uh, that's Leroy in the background. Uh, he is, uh, he's very much, uh, comfy in my bed right now. In my very much not made bed right now. Yeah. And that's okay. Think you'd go for a chick like I, son? Not in a million years. Really? I mean, yeah, she's got major issues, but don't you think she's kinda hot? Girls annoy me. 
Dude, let's fucking go. That's why I love you, man. <laughs> they do. Oh, but how about guys then? Knock it off. Weren't you dating back in middle school, bro? Oh, I get it. You got higher standards now, huh? Must be nice to be so popular that you can get any chick you want. Us normal guys can possibly understand. Oh my god. Such high school boys. I hate it. Yeah. Goodbye. Fuck off. Hey man. Whatever. Girls are a pain in the ass. Right, Makoto? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> quit, sh quit short off. Come on. Uh, uh. Uh, I didn't mean it to come out that way. That's the case. Looks uncomfortable. Girls don't even talk to me, but they're always coming up and asking me out. What do they know about me? You guys done over here? <laughs> Same thing as last night, right? A little overtime practice, and then we'll clean up. All right, let's do this. Hmm. <laughs> sure, let's do it. Two of them are willing to help you train today too. You feel your relationship with Dasuke and Kao get has gone. It's stronger now. Wow. Fuck. Patrick. Da -ba -da -ba -da. All right, let's go home. After practice, you cleaned up and went home. Welcome back. Chopping the day. The fridge is full of food. Hey, can I have a word with you? You go to Judas a lot. Pretty often. That ass Adachi keeps the vanishing every now and again. I figure he's probably slack off around Judas whenever he does. If you see him hanging around when you're at Judas, he's probably goofing around. So if you see Adachi at Judas, tell him tell him off for me, okay? Remember that you've seen Adachi in the food court before. The next time you go to Judas, you should be on the lookout for Adachi. Oh my gosh, I love Adachi. Wow. I, I I want to help this stupid girl with the stupid fucking quiz show. Girl has trauma, a bad attitude, and is hot. <laughs> what I hear is hot. <laughs> oh my gosh. You gay piece of shit. <laughs> hey. Hey, Mako, how are things? You should be used to life here by now. Yeah, I'll talk to you. Haha, <laughs> you bored? Well, have a seat. Hmm. We haven't had time to talk like this since you got here, huh? Dojima is desperately casting out, casting about for a topic to discuss. Oh, uh, well, uh, how's school? It's fun. I see. see. That's good to hear. Your uh, school days will be over before you know it. Make sure you have fun while you can. Dojima is nodding to himself. What else? Uh, oh yeah, uh, how about your friends? Looks like you've made plenty of them. Um, Dojima is scowling. I'm not saying who you can and can't hang out with, but you know what I'm talking about, right? To say it straight out, man. Okay, I don't have enough courage for that. Yes. Huh, huh so you did notice. Dojima is nodding. I believe he's talking about that time when uh fucking what's his face headphone guy he starts with a K. He whenever K came up and was like, "Dude, look at this fucking sick katana." And we got arrested for it. <sighs> for some reason, wherever there is an incident, there you are. I wish I didn't have to consider this, but Killings began around the time you came to town. My job is all about eliminating the random element. I look only at the facts. If you keep getting caught up in my job, then... What's wrong? 
Big Bro didn't do anything bad. I I know I I didn't mean it like that. But but you're bullying. <laughs> oh my God, not a go. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I can tell that they're trying to get us attached to this young girl. I bet she's going to die sometime during the course of this game. But oh my gosh, I love this girl so much. I'm not bullying him, we were just having a little talk. It's getting late, go to sleep. Okay. <laughs> Sheesh. She's really taking a shine to you. Look, just don't get yourself involved in anything dangerous. As long as you're safe, everything's fine. Your parents didn't ask me to raise your grades or anything. Seems Dojima is genuinely worried about you. Feel a faint bump for me between you and Dojima? Let's fucking go! I hope thou thou art I, blah 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 blah. A hierophant. Glowy. Yippee. Things here might be a little different from what you're used to, but this is a good town. Though it's a little dangerous right at the moment. Now then, it's, it's about time for you. Turn in. Get some sleep. Night. Night. <laughs> Good night, Detective Daddy. I love you. I mean, we're cool. Uh, custom magic for the day. Hey, wanna go inside the TV now? There's no harm in getting some real combat experience. I don't see a reason to. I'm sorry. See you later. Don't be disappointed! Shut up! I'll be back! <sighs> uh, is there anybody available? Wait, what day is it? Is it Friday? Uh, drama club it doesn't say they, they don't meet today soccer club doesn't meet today what do I do what do I do um, I can see if Adachi is fucking off hey you oh huh oh it's you What's the matter? Can I help you? Dojima sent me. Really? D D Dojima san? It sucks. W obviously, I'm working here. It's easy to investigate here with all the people around. It's cool in the summer and warm in the winter. It's a pretty good place to. Oops. Uh, yeah, I think I've said enough. It seems Adachi is slacking off. Well, I got with you too, Mumboro. Oh. That's a little strange. <laughs> what are you doing here? Killing time? It's tough to do it out here in the sticks, isn't it? There's nothing here. It's not like the city at all. It's not so bad. Oh, yeah? Oh, but you're from the city too, right? You'll find out soon enough. This town really is dead. <sighs> Get this. My first assignment here was tracking down a cat. My suit got so dirty, and they wouldn't let me expense the dry cleaning bill. Next, I played Peacemaker in a spat some married couple was having. Can't believe they got the police doing that stuff. Adachi seems unsatisfied with country life. But it's been more dangerous lately, so I, I can't kick back. There's that one case, you know, it's still not solved yet. The higher-ups don't know what to do. They keep changing procedure on the fly. Sorry. So, I mean, I'm not make. I, I'm not making you nervous. I, I hope I'm not making you nervous. 
<laughs> you guys have nothing to worry about, you know? But the, us police are on the job! He says that Adachi cares for you. You feel you understand Adachi a little bit more. Let's go! More confidants! What is this, the fool? Oh, it's the jester. Oh, man. That... I mean, don't talk about my boy like that, but also, yup, he is such a jester, my well, god. You know. Well, time for me to get back to work. Very smooth, Fadachi. Whew, that was close. Fadachi doesn't seem to want to see that, doesn't seem to want to see that old woman. See ya. I better go. You hurry on home, too. I bet that's his mom. <laughs> Don't tell Doji Masad I was in Juness, okay? You watched Adachi go back to work, then went home. <laughs> oh, God, Adachi. Young men recklessly riding their motorcycles, disturbing the peace of a quiet rural town. Our special report took a turn for the violent when one of the apparent leaders attacked the camera crew. The hell are you punks doing here? That voice. This ain't a show! Get bent! Still up to the same old tricks. Do you know him, Dad? Uh, well, I know him through work. His name's Kanji Tatsumi. He's quite a handful. He's been crushing biker gangs in the area since middle school. But I thought he'd gone into a high school and started attending class. Huh. Man, that blur sure is pointless. It's completely obvious who it is. The guy's family runs a historic textile shop. I think what happened was he crushed the local bikers all by himself because the noise kept his mother up at night. It's a nice gesture, but he's way too violent. At this rate, his mother will have to apologize again. Oh. The weather report's showing on the bottom. It's going to rain tomorrow. I'll make sure to hang the laundry inside the house. <sighs> Whoa! It started raining. I guess the weather report was right. That means the show's probably gonna be on tonight. I hope we don't see anyone. Yeah, that'd be best. But if we do, maybe we'll see some kind of clue that can point us toward the killer. Well, everyone, don't forget to check your TV tonight. Got it? Thank you. Thank you, Lil says. <laughs> Biker gangs. Those words sound kind of cool together. <laughs> yes, they do. Yes, they do. Oh my gosh. You are too pure for this world. Alright. I wonder if anybody's going to appear on the Midnight Channel. I'll be so weird if did. Wow! Seems to be a man. He looks like a high schooler. The image is unfocused and it's hard to tell who it is. Let's call Yasuke. Oh, it's you. I was just about to call your cell. So what do you think? That was a guy, wasn't it? I wish I could tell what he looked like. Let's get together and talk more about it tomorrow.
We will now hold a meeting on our investigation of the serial kidnapping slash murder case here in Inaba. Dude, take a breath. Oh, then does that make this place our special headquarters? Um, it's not much of a headquarters. It's out in the open. Yes, exactly. You're supposed to be the nicely put, Yukiko. You're supposed to be the nice one in the group, Yukiko. <sighs> special headquarters. Hmm, that does have a nice ring to it. Anyways, as for what was on last night, who was that? I saw it too. I couldn't get a good view of the person's face, but it was a guy, wasn't it? Tell everyone that you saw someone who looked like a high schooler. So that's how I looked on TV. Hmm. Wait a moment. Didn't all the victims have one thing in common? That they were females with ties to the first incident? That's what we thought. But we still don't know who exactly we saw. In my case, the image on the Midnight Channel changed after I was kidnapped, right? Yeah. The screen got clear all of a sudden, and the program looked like some low-budget TV show. Come to think of it, maybe Teddy was right. Maybe we were seeing the other Yukiko from that world. But last night, we couldn't clearly see whoever it was. Could that mean... he isn't inside the TV yet? If so, then... He's still safe for now. Uh-huh. I think that's safe to assume. If we can figure out who he is, can we prevent him from being taken? Yeah. And if all goes well, we might catch the killer in the bargain. But to do that, we need to know who the latest Midnight Channel star is. I hate to say it, but I guess we'll have to wait another night and see what happens. <clears throat> well, that means if my deductions are correct... Though the image was hard to make out, and we can't say for sure who it was, it was definitely a young male. But if that's the case, it goes entirely against our prior assumptions. Since we cannot identify the person at this time, we have no choice but to wait and see what happens. That's exactly what we just said. Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny, Chiang. <laughs> oh no, my, my funny bone. <laughs> Not again. Sorry. <laughs> this is how Yukiko really is, huh? Who'd have thought? By the way, about that guy we saw, I get the feeling I've seen him before. Pretty recently, too. Oh, you too? Yeah, I've been thinking the same thing since last night. Well, let's check the TV again tonight and think about it more tomorrow. Yukiko makes herself laugh as much as I do. Dude, it, sure. <laughs> I don't think Yukiko is laughing at herself. She's laughing at Chie. And how much of a dumbass she is. <laughs> Yeah, you can't... I am the dumbass. Yes, you're right. I know. I know. Let's check the TV again tonight and think of it more tomorrow. <laughs> when are you gonna stop that, you crazy hyena? <laughs> That's a good one, Chie. I will say, it does seem kind of forced at this point. I feel like there's more of her like inner trauma that we don't know about Welcome back. Thanks daddy o. <laughs> Bad influence on Nanako. Cool. Trauma is humor, you're right.
figure appeared. Image is unfocused. I feel like you've seen him before. Don't point that cat gun at me. No, stop it. Did you see that? Be kind of yeah, I think so too. I knew I saw him somewhere. It was on TV. He was on that special news report. He's one scary dude. He was even yelling at the camera to get bent. <laughs> all right. So we finally have a lead. Let's all get together tomorrow, okay? Oh, I almost forgot. It's kind of off subject, but as long as you're on the line, mind if I ask something? It's something I've been meaning to ask for a while. So, what do you think about Yukiko and Chie? I mean, it's <laughs> not mince words. Which one's your type? <laughs> Both? I mean, <laughs> if I were to be honest, <laughs> um, I, d d well, I know a lot more about Chie. That's the problem here. I don't feel like Yukiko has a chance. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah, I mean, we're going to say both so I can keep my options open. You don't have a particular preference in girls. What? Bullshit. Your understanding has increased. Yo! <laughs> Seriously? Well, you get a better chance that way. Hey, but don't worry. This is just between you and me. Okay? See you tomorrow. No, but stop it. No, stop with the cat gun. Cat gun is not okay. The one who was on last night. It's that guy, right? Kanji Tatsumi, huh? He definitely didn't look like the social type. Now there is an understatement. Isn't he really scary? Did you see the new special the other day? Yeah, I saw it. You mean the special on biker gangs? I watched it too. Okay, yeah, you can you can drown the cat in the soup. That's fine. You can make him you can, you can make it, it be torture. Yes. He wasn't like that when he was younger, though. You know him, Yukiko? Uh huh. But we haven't talked to each other in a long time. His family runs a textile shop, and we've been a customer of theirs for many years. So I speak with Kanjikun's mother from time to time. Oh, why don't we go there now? We might be able to talk to him in person. Sounds good. At the very least, we can ask if anything strange has come up lately. I wouldn't want to run into him in a dark alley, but I'm pretty sure he won't fly off the handle at his family's store. All right, then let's get going. If things get rough, we're counting on you guys. You are either very, very, like, hyper or very tired right now. Hello. Ah, Yuki-chan. It's so nice to see you. Well then, if you'll excuse me, ma'am. I'm sorry that I couldn't help more. It's all right. You've given me plenty to think about. Thank you. What's up with him, weirdo? Hmm. Uh, never seen him before. Yuki-chan, you're as lovely as always. Your features are starting to remind me of your mother when she was young. How can I help you today? Are you out shopping with your friends? Oh, um, well, actually... Hey, this scarf. I've seen this somewhere before. Oh, you're right. Where was that? Oh, it was that place inside the TV! That's right. That room with those faceless posters. Mm. Then it's that announcer's. Are you acquaintances of Miss Yamano? Uh, well, kinda. Um, did Miss Yamano happen to have a scarf like this? Yes. It was a special order she placed. 
She actually ordered a pair, but in the end, she said she only wanted the women's scarf. It left us with no choice but to sell this one separately. Oh man, there is a connection to the first case. What are we gonna do? How should I know? Hello? Delivery here for the Tatsumis. Oh, I'll be right there. I'm sorry. You'll have to excuse me. Oh, it's okay. We should get going. I'll come again, ma'am. Is that so? Well, then please say hello to your mother for me. It really is connected to the first case after all. But it's just a scarf. Would the killer target someone just because of that? Damn it, what's going on? Come on, let's talk outside. Hmm? It's Kanji-kun. Well, quick, hide! <clears throat> You're not fooling anyone, you know. Shh, I can't hear what they're saying. He was dropped on Kashi's conversation with the boy. T tomorrow's fine with me. Huh? S school. Of course I'm going to school. Then I'll meet you at the gates after school tomorrow. D did, he, did he say he was interested? He's a guy. And I'm a guy, but he's interested in me? <laughs> huh? What the hell are you pricks looking at? He sounds like a 40 year old man. Well, you scared the well. hell out of me! He's even worse in person than on TV! Well, I mean, it, this is this is dubbed from Japanese, so I mean, it's not like, uh. <laughs> it's not like they did the uh, best job of it, but yeah, I mean, he, he definitely doesn't look like a high schooler, you know? <laughs> the one on TV last night was definitely Kanji kun. Yeah, and I just realized something. Remember the common points we were talking about? His mom fits the pattern. She's a woman, and she knew Ms. Yamano. But it was her son who appeared on TV. So what does that mean? I don't know. I, hmm, I'd say that they're both targets because both of them, in some way, has... Well, I, I think that the mother's the actual target, but Kanji is... I, I think that her mother is the actual target, but uh, the killer is using Kanji to get to his mother. Because I think that the good... Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. They're both targets. Whoa, I hadn't thought about that. Oh, maybe it's I shot that like target. Oh, okay, uh, good, good for you, I think. Oh, maybe it's similar to my case. If you think about it, my mother fit the victim profile more than I did. She was the one who dealt directly with Miss Yamano, but I was the one who was targeted. Does that mean it'll be the kid again instead of the mother? But if that's true, then the killer's motive makes no sense at all. It'd have nothing to do with silencing witnesses or revenge or anything. You think we're on the wrong track? Maybe even the first case had nothing to do with grudges or revenge. Or is there some kind of secret in the textile shop itself? Oh, I'm totally lost. But we can't ignore this. Hmm. Why don't we just go ahead and ask Kanji himself? We could at least see if anything odd's happened lately. He scares the wits out of me, but... Hey, wasn't Kanji making plans with that weird kid a moment ago? Something about meeting up at school? I heard he's been skipping school ever since the new year started. Doesn't that seem a little suspicious? Yeah, something did seem weird. It's suspicious, all right. There's something funny going on here. I can sense it. Sense? You sound like Teddy. Still, we might find some clues. All right. Let's try staking out both Kanji and his family's store. 
We definitely don't want the killer getting ahead of us. That being said, Yukiko, can I have your cell number? Hey, was this your plan all along? Uh, no. I got everybody's phone number except for hers. And the Y section of my address book needs some filling out. <sighs> While we're on the subject, could you stop calling me at night just to tell dirty jokes? You really sound like a pervert. Hey, I'm trying to have a conversation with Yukiko here. Hmm. Oh, that reminds me. I need to buy tofu on my way home. Oh, she didn't hear a word I said. <laughs> okay, then. The stakeout is set for tomorrow. Hmm. Stakeouts? Tailing people? <laughs> I'm getting goosebumps. Jesus. You, Nanaka. Boys at school pretend they're in gangs when they run around. Yikes. Fine, I guess go to sleep. God. Has the target arrived at school? God. Yes, ma'am. Visual ID confirmed. Target arrived in zone near the end of his mess break, with mother issued rations in hand. Current status, in the bathroom, fixing his hair. The target was acting nervous. I left my position before he had a chance to pick on me. I wonder what kind of plans they made. It didn't seem like he knew that boy very well. Well, I think there's something more subtle. Oh, he's here! I didn't keep you waiting, I hope. No, I, uh, I just got here too. Because... Uh, both of them... What in the world was that? Because both of them didn't just see, you know, all four of them just stare blankly at both of them. Anyways, we gotta hurry after them or we'll lose them! Okay, then let's split up into two groups. One team will follow Kanji, and the other will stake out the shop. Roger that! How should we split the teams? Mm. <sighs> I feel like the most reasonable option is just to pair with Yasuke, so that... But then again, if I pair with Chie, that way my boy Yasuke can pair with Yukiko. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, no, I can't. I can't. Pair with Chie? Really? Should I pair with Chie? Alright, I'll pair with Chie. Fine. I wouldn't mind going with you, but you'd leave Yukiko with Yosuke? That worries me. For other reasons. See? See? Oh man, they're almost out of sight. Come on, Yosuke! So I'm pairing up with Chie? Mm, okay. All right. Oh, we need to pretend we're on a date to make it look natural. Oh my god. Uh, not in a million years. There'll be no need for that if we stay out of sight. Sheesh. Let's hurry up and go. I wonder if those two will be all right. Oh, <laughs> um, that leaves us in charge of staking out the textile shop. So, shall we? <laughs> Sorry about the wait. This one's for you. Yeah. <laughs> Everything seems fine at the shop. I hope it stays that way. Do you think the culprit will come? I, I I doubt it. Honestly, yeah. Our efforts might be fruitless, but maybe that's for the best. 
It would be scary if the culprit did show up. But if they do, I'll do what I can to help you catch them. You all saved my life. I don't want to be the only one doing nothing. I mean, I'm sure there's something I can do. Oh, sorry. I went on and on without realizing. I, I guess I'm a little nervous. I've never chatted with a boy my age like this before. Wait, what? <laughs> you coming on to me now? The fuck? Uh, Chie, of course, has no problem getting along with guys because of her personality. But I think she's had more fun hanging out with you and Yosuke lately. <laughs> you keep admitting she got no friends. Well, okay, well... <laughs> The thing is, like, the, the, the thing is, like, Chie and Yukiko get along so well together, and Yukiko is, like, she just has some insecurities, you know? for me. Oh. Oh. Jesus. Yukiko. Back up a little bit. <laughs> Says Yukiko's gratitude and affection. Cool. <laughs> okay. Priestess Arcana. answer since I help out around the inn, but feel free to call any time. Oh my god. Man, this is weird. Yeah. We definitely stand out. Uh-huh. No, I mean them. I get this weird feeling about them. Weird? What about them's weird? Um, I don't know how to put it. Maybe it's just my imagination. <laughs> hey, how do you think the others are doing? Beats me. For all we know, he's hitting on Yukiko as we speak. Yeah, no. He's not like you. Yukiko doesn't seem to be interested in that stuff anyway. Uh-huh. Right. Uh-huh. Wait, are you saying he's interested in her? Huh? I, I, I wouldn't know. We don't really talk about that kind of stuff. <laughs> now I'm even more suspicious. You know something, don't you? <laughs> I seriously don't know. It's not like we've been hanging out that long. What the hell are you two doing? Oh, well, you see, we're... We're just two crazy lovebirds. What do you mean, bird? Play along, bird brain. Didn't I see you guys yesterday? <laughs> Come on. It just so happened that we were walking behind you guys. Pure coincidence. Hey, our houses are just over that way, so we'll be going now. Um, look. We weren't planning on getting in you guys' way, and there's nothing strange about it either. Oh my god. S strange? Why can't you keep your big mouth shut? Whoa, 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 wait. Damn it! Say what you think. Uh, you got it all wrong. <sighs> you know, I could just... I could just not press anything. This just be the end of the playthrough, you know? To just keep on running around this one gazebo and just let them run? Okay, I gotcha. I got them. Torture them. <laughs> Good god. Oh, man. Kanji, you gay bastard. <laughs> this is what you get. It's chase music too, my god. Uh. Well, 
like that whole push it up a rock cup of hell for eternity oh god all right hey, I, I can't you listening damn it it seriously ain't like that We regret to inform that our mission failed. <laughs> there was nowhere to hide. Well, let's wait here a little longer. Maybe Kanji kun will come home. Yeah. Huh? What are you guys doing here? You're those stupid lovebirds I just saw. We're not a couple! Why are you assholes following me around? What the hell's going on? I ain't saying this is you guys' fault, but damn it! Hey, uh, mind if we ask something? Has anything strange happened to you lately? Huh? Strange? What's this strange stuff, huh? Are you saying that I'm strange? Huh? No, 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 I, I didn't mean- You shitheads better get the hell out of my face or I'm taking you down! What? Wait, why? I look like I'm joking! <laughs> Jesus, yes, okay. <sighs> oh, too much running. So you think strange happened? Like, besides him seeing you for like the third time that day. I mean, yeah, you're right. I was thinking that well, too. Nothing happened today, but... so I guess everything's okay. Mm. But it's already been a few days since he appeared on the Midnight Channel. If this is anything like Yukiko's case, it'll happen soon. Then we can't let our guard down. I think we should come back hey, tomorrow to check like, up on him. You know it, bro. Looks like we got no choice. Let's go home. I'm wiped. Oh! Welcome home, big bro! I love you, Nanako. Let me guess, I'm too tired. Oh yeah, I gotta watch the Midnight Channel tonight. Of course, it's raining. Sound bad. He should be fine. I wish I could believe that. You like just saw this bitch. How did he get napped already? Well, you know what? I mean, stranger things have happened in this game, you know? Like a fucking fox just coming in and being like, hey! You know, people that, you know, <laughs> come over and you're you're supposed to make bonds with people I'm one of them it's just like what the fuck Ugh. it's going to rain again tonight maybe the midnight channel will come on then we'll know for sure if something happened to kanji -kun or not I'll make sure to check out the TV at midnight talk to you later Yes, the magic furry coming to tell you to make friends, but mainly with him, specifically. What? <laughs> Who's the furry? What? I, I'm, I'm confused now. Hold on. Magic furry coming to tell you. 
Oh, the fo- No! It, 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 it's an actual fox, though. Like... Unless it's a, it's it's a, it's like a little baby like controlling the. Unless it's like a little baby inside the fox is just like controlling the fox. Would be great. <gasps> Wait a second. Okay, so. All right. You know how the grandfather came in and was like, "Hey." My legs feel bad, and my grand, my grandson give me this uh this leaf every now and then, and like it gives you like little uh it, it gives you healy powers, and uh, the fox gave me it, and it was like, oh hey, it's that one, it give me healy powers, cool. What if the fox is a mechanical fox? It is just made by that grandson, and it's being controlled by that grandson. Big brain, big bean, big bean. Anyway, let's watch TV. Foxy from FNAF be like, no, stop, stop it, no, we are not bringing FNAF into this. See something on the screen. The image is clear and sharp. Hello, dear viewers. It's time for Bad Bad Bathhouse. Okay. Tonight I'll introduce a superb site for those searching for sublime love that surpasses the separation of the sexes. <laughs> I'm your host, Kanji Tatsumi, serving you this scandalously special sneak in report. Goodness gracious, just imagine the things that might happen to me there. Woo! Well then, let's get this show on the road. Toodaloo! Man's wearing a sumo diaper. And he's skinny as shit. Kaji is supposed to be a high schooler, isn't he? He, he is. He's supposed to be a high schooler, yes. This high schooler bad, quote unquote badass that you know skips school all the time and is just yeah. <coughs> Apparently, secretly gay as fuck. Hey, what the? I mean, case so plus too plus to get to this point across. It really was Kanji. Yosuke is flirted. Guess he likes what he sees. I mean, you know what? I wouldn't be surprised. <sighs> Given the pattern so far, Kanji's already inside the TV. I wonder what the Midnight Channel really is. Hmm. At first, I thought it was one of those paranormal things, but when I gave it a try, it was real. Turns out it's actually connected to another world. Can't you get yassified? Stop. No. Stop it. <laughs> if there's a rumor going around, that means a bunch of people are watching it. How did the rumor go? If you stare into a turned off TV on a rainy night, no one in their right mind would try something that ridiculous, don't you think? Unless someone urged them to. But if you actually try, it does work. And not just once. If this rumor spreads and everyone starts watching the Midnight Channel... It could cause a huge panic. If Teddy is right, the missing people themselves create the stuff we see. So it's not random. It's specifically related to whoever goes missing. Huh. Yukiko had a show too. 
But she doesn't remember doing anything like that. Um, this might be a little off subject, but the culprit is probably watching the shows that come on, right? No doubt. He's probably sitting back and enjoying... Oh, wait a sec. I bet he is enjoying it. He's probably laughing his head off watching the show that comes on after he throws people into the TV. Ah, oh, I get it. Yeah, it's definitely possible. Ugh. Now when I think of the killer, I get this image of a total sicko. I want to see everything about you, Yuki-chan. Oh, eh, eh. Wait. So if people saw Yuki-go's show, do you think people were watching what happened to me, too? Oh, that is it! That killer is dead meat! I'm gonna leave footprints all over his face! Guys! Did he not think the literal murderer was a sicko before? Well, I mean... It, not really. It, it, it... Not as much of a pervert as this theory tends to... You know, bring in, so. First we save Kanji, then we crush the killer. Finally, we crush the killer and send him to hell! Got it? Very cool. <laughs> Chio sounds like <laughs> Rainbow Dash. Chie. Those last two were the same thing. Uh, I know. <laughs> Whee! Hey, Teddy, someone's here, right? Oh, yep. I think someone's here. You think? Do you know where he is? I don't know. We think it's a boy named Kanji. I don't know. What's wrong? Not feeling well? Well, I sniff and I sniff, but I still can't tell where the smell comes from. Aren't you thinking too much about too many things? I mean, last time you were wondering about who you really are and how long you've been here. Your head's empty to begin with, dude. Don't stress out over stuff too much. You're right. Whoa, he's seriously down about this. If you can't figure out where Kanji is, we're in deep trouble. We can't just wander around aimlessly in a place like this. I know what might help. You should give me a clue about this Kanji person. It's just a feeling I have. I think I could concentrate better with it. Do you have anything that could give me a good understanding of him? Something about Kanji, huh? I can't really think of anything besides all the rumors about him. Yeah, it's not like we know him that well. I just need some sort of hint. Something that tells me what he's really like. Why don't we ask around and find people who know Kanji-kun personally? His mother? Duh? Ask about Kanji too. She should wonder where he's wandered off to now. He's always like this. You know, th there was a small boy who came in asking about him not too long ago. I talked to him too, but I haven't seen him around lately. The boy who talked to Kanji could be the small boy from before. If it was him and he was with Kanji, he might know something. He decided to search for the boy.
Maybe up in near the school? No, I. It's after school. I doubt. I doubt he'd be here. Hmm. from around here could I ask you something you know about the Mori Ranmaru years ago I was the manager of the Konishi liquor store right here in the town's very shopping district I kind of lost the will to do business and I quit my job as the manager anyway to be honest I shouldn't have come out here to the country but I can't go back home and be added you know you think you can get some Mori Ranmaru for me Local product section of Kanishi Sansor. Yeah, 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 I'll do that, whatever. Uh, hello, cat. Okay. Jonas, maybe? Jonas... Okay. Yep. It's not... I must have missed him in the shopping district. Unless he is legitimately at the high school. I guess I'm looking around the school then. Or could be right outside the Doshima residence. I guess I'll look around the stupid school. Hmm. Are there milfs in this game? Um, not. I don't think so. I, I haven't seen any. Not that I know of. Why are you asking about MILFs? I guess I should have asked that question beforehand, but you know. not someone from school, I don't think I've noticed him. Can I ask you to do something for me? Alright, well, what I want you to do is, do you know that girl from our class who always goes up to the roof? 
I want you to go see what she's up to. No, no, that's not what I meant. I mean, uh, I just wonder what she does. What she does up there, that's all. I'm just asking you about it. Okay. There you go. Sure. Push the girl off the roof. No, stop it. No. <laughs> the girl that goes up on the roof all the time is Chie. <laughs> I am not pushing Chie off the roof. I mean, there's another one. But it's no, I'm not pushing Chie off the roof. Stop it. Maybe, maybe the guy is on the roof though. Why not? It'd be funny. Stop it. Oh wait, hold on. I think wasn't there one of your classmates who was interested in this girl? Oh, what's the matter? Ask why she's on the roof. I just like it up here. You can see the open sky. It feels good, doesn't it? It doesn't seem like you can ask her any more today. You should come back. Cool. Thanks. But can I not practice building, maybe? Oh, you have something. I don't know anything about boy wearing a hat. I'm not sure, but it does sound like a person like that. It's jammed out. This is changing the subject, but would you mind listening to me for a moment? I'm making another crystal radio, but I don't have all the materials I need. Ritz wire for the antenna. Do you know what that is? I need the twisted enameled kind. Cambalize the TV parts of it. I couldn't figure out. Let's break it down. Blah, blah, blah. Sure, whatever. Ritz wire. Uh... What do you want? A uh, problem, to be honest with you. Think, uh, sure, whatever. Things. Well, the thing is, my dad suddenly started making these plastic models. It's fine and all. He can do what he wants, but he got glue all over my desk. I don't like this. Yeah, I know. Her her dad is making sex dolls and having sex with them. Yes, I know. Can't put anything on my desk anymore. I want to replace it, but I don't have a fitting board. Close down too, so I don't know what to do. I need to get glue on it again, so a thin, cheap one is fine. You're the best. Yikes. Oh my gosh. I... Where is this boy? I guess the, I'll just start asking around the, do, the, 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 the shopping district, I guess. Exactly like me. You see, she's my twin sister. As soon as school and she wanders off somewhere, I wonder where she is. We're the same, so we should be in the same place. That, okay. Sure, you saw him around here.
I'm out of shopping. Shopping! Shopping time! Nope, that's the diner. Stop it. Shopping! Country shop. I wonder if he's not feeling well. I thought I saw him on the TV a while ago, but maybe it was someone else. See him, could you tell him that I'm worried about him? It'd be nice to see if he was okay. I guess not shopping at this place. Oh my gosh. Maybe in here? Reset my art. 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 Cool. Bye. Oh my goodness. Talking to a bunch of people in Junas, he's a particular sort of boy. I don't know what he was doing, but he ain't my business, but I know he's usually hanging around Junas. I tend to see him more on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and holidays. Okay. That's very specific. Hello. Whoa, something's here. A, a box? When did it? Whoa, where did this guy come from? Dude, it looks scary too. Oh, this apron. I think I've seen it at the shrine before. Thank you. Huh? Curious with leaves? Huh? Cooperate with us? Are you serious? So he wants money in exchange for fixing us up? What's with this guy? It acts like it understands what we're talking about. It yipped again. Maybe it really does understand what we're saying. But, but when you think about it, that means the police on duty and whatnot didn't find this fox, right? If it followed after us, then it really is something. Huh? You think it really understands us? What should we do? Well, I'd feel bad if we trapped it. It doesn't look like it'll do us any harm. What do you think? I guess yeah. we could let the fox I'm thinking about help. what happened at the shrine. I don't know. Please, please. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't you think this curing would be a big help for us? Huh? Are you suggesting 
we take it into that other world? <sighs> hmm. Mm, I guess that might work. It doesn't seem like it's going to leave that easily either. And I definitely don't want it being all sulky and getting up to mischief in the store. First Yukiko, now Kanji, Tatsumi. They aren't just, you know, all in case maybe it has something to do with their school. Who knows? Just edits about things we don't know. But man, that Kanji was total chaos on that show. He seems like such a badass before, too. We should concentrate on saving Kanji Kun before the fog appears, okay? Yeah, yeah, you're right. We gotta start from there. It, yeah. Can I not talk to people about what I found? Okay. I guess we're going back on to town. Woohoo! Alright. So, Tuesday, Thursdays, and holidays. A Junus. So, I'm gonna hang out with the boys. I'll hang out with the the boys. So I'll spend time with Nanako. Oh, um. No, I'm not going to punt the child. No, stop it. Stop. Big bro. Nanako is fidgeting. Go ahead and ask. Yeah. Okay, um, well, Nanako looks relieved. Are you an only child? I believe so. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> so you're just like me. Oh, but I have you now, so... Nanako is smiling cheerfully. A while ago, Daddy told me that our family won't get any bigger. But now I have a big brother! Nanako beams at you with a smile that covers her entire face. Through that smile, you feel your relationship has grown deeper. I want to hear about your school. Anika has begged you to talk to her. Try to talk about various things. Yo! According to the weather report, we won't have to worry about the fog for a while. Let's to keep cool, like usual. We can save the J and still keep our work skill sharp. That's a good plan. Yeah, it's not going to do anyone any good if we get very anxious. Let's be sure to use the time we have until the next foggy day to our advantage so we can save them for sure. Yippee and wahoo. Hey everyone, they posted the test results! Awful moment of truth. Oh well, wanna check it out? I think I got like, a crush wrong? See, an average score, the fuck does that mean? It's not too far from mine. I always say passable is still passing. What the fuck does that mean, bitch? I got one question wrong. Heal some solidarity from your social link friends. Lunch break is almost over. You decided to return to class. Cool. I'm 
to purple. Shut up, I'll see you on the field. <laughs> really interested. Maybe you should show up to soccer practice after school. I would love to, but I have to do the thing. With the thing. I have to find the boy. I need to find the boy. First, you need to gather information for Teddy. Which is what I'm trying to do, you asshole. Junas. Hey, yo. You. There's something you need. Many people from the town come and meet here. It's a very convenient location, isn't it? Wasn't this the boy who met with Kanji some time ago? He may know something about Kanji. You were asking if anything seemed strange when I spoke to Kanjiku? Yes? Hmm, very well. It seems to be an urgent matter, so I'll simply tell you. If you're asking about recent events, then yes, there was something out of the ordinary. It was something I felt when I was with him, so I told him outright that he seemed to be an odd person. After I said that, his expression changed all of a sudden. I was quite surprised. I, on that basis, I, I believe his actions were somewhat forced and unnatural throughout the time I was with him. He may have some sort of complex, though I have no proof of this. It seems to have a complex or something of that nature. You know, purported? But purported! Woohoo! Kanji's purported reaction to the phrase odd person. Maybe this is enough of a clue for Teddy to go on. For Teddy as soon as possible. Aye aye, Captain. Hey, let's go. Oh, wait. Yep, I was already in your nest. Mm hmm. All right, let's brace ourselves. Here, any clues? Oh, you found some. Oh, you found out more about Kanji. Uh-huh. A complex. Um, that's it? That's all I have to go on? You're working me to the stuffing. Oh well, then I'll open my nose up real wide and sniff real hard. Okay. Good job. Mm. Good job, Teddy. Oh, I think I found something. It feels like our target. Is this it? Follow me! Oh my gosh. His palace is a sauna. Oh, that's funny. Is it just me, or does the fog here seem kind of different? My glasses are fogging up. Man, it's hot in here. This place is like a... He <laughs> he Come here, pussycat. Oh my god. Oh, such well-defined pecs. There's no need to be scared. Uh... Now just relax. Wait a sec. I don't want to go. <laughs> Is Kanji Kun really here, Teddy? The nose knows. We're really going in here? I can already feel the sweat rolling down my back. That's because it's so hot. <laughs> oh, it's a bathhouse. Oh, it's hilarious. I have Jack Frost. We should be good. Please 
it's really steamy. Why do I feel a little chill down my fuzzy spine? I think I caught a cold. My nose is totally useless too. Conchacoon, where are you? Answer us. Alright. Uh, we're gonna... I don't really like the gag outfit. We'll just go with regular for just for now. I like the glasses much more than the quote-unquote goofy glasses. Oh my gosh! How did I miss? How did I miss? Two eggs. We caught you off guard. Uh, I get it, cause they look like a guard. Uh, uh, uh. Two enemies left. Persona. You can try to be an enemy. You keep going. It's down. We have to be gone. Ah, uh, they're very holy. Very funny. So funny. Uh, <laughs> anyway. Let's do half money. That one. That one. Yeah, I know you're hilarious. I know. I know. I know. Stairway. There we go. That's a strong enemy. This oh. last one was. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Can I have this one? Sure, sure. Galactic punt. Chia, <laughs> good God! Go. All right, Chia. Oh my gosh, that's hilarious! <laughs> Twin dragons, let's fucking go! Oh my God, that's hilarious! Oh, I love that. Alright. Sure. I'll take a chest key. Oh, man. That's hilarious. I love that. Oh, man. I love this game. You. Two enemies. You can attack before them. Persona. Uh, probably one. Looks like one rock. So, yep. One enemy down. It's down. Should we show oh. right? Yeah. I could 
didn't do it. Just one enemy left. Looks like they could have lent a hand, but get it because they laid. Oh my god, shut up. Stop. Stop. You need to go to bed. How could I ever put this humor to rest? Oh my god, please. There are three enemies! Careful! Uh what the fuck is that? It's a baby cupid imp. What the fuck, dude. Alright, well, um I know you do this, so uh That's it, Yosuke! What is it, Yosuke kun? It's down. Oh, me, me, oh yes. Do it, Chie. Do it. Fuck yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. I love it. Yes, yes, yes. Ha ha ha. I know. The fucking. Yes, I know. 69. Very funny. Uh ha ha ha. Oh my god. Such a child. I'm the child? Dude, you're literally like four years younger than me. Don't even get me started. Um... <sighs> Wait, is this the same... No, it's not. Just one okay. enemy left! Counting on you! Persona! Damn, it's not going down! It's over! I couldn't do it! Shh! No! Stop! Stop making hand puns! Someone else's turn. There. I couldn't do it. Someone finish it off. Seems pretty handy. Stop. 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 Just stop. Hang tight and go for it. I'm pissed now. And of course he's my true escapes. strength. I fucking hate those hands so much. <sighs> Let me give you a hand on the way out. Ha ha ha. Happy now. Why is it so steamy in here? Does it have something to do with kanji I don't really get it. Do you know what it is, Sensei? I think I get the hints. That's my Sensei. Is there anything you don't know? Trust me, I know about that gay shit. Fire? Fire? Yes, it is. Okay. Cool. Uh, did I try Fire's anything? Ultra. No, I did not. Three okay. enemies left. I just... Someone else's turn. Imagine being gay. It couldn't be me. Uh huh. Persona. Sure. Here goes, Sophia.
completely miss. God. Uh, four enemies ambushed you! Panic. Cool. Yosuke's dizzy! Oh my god! This isn't good! Stop! S Sensei? Are you alright? Alright, well, uh, let's it's try this. Over. So persistent. Hmm, I let my guard down. Four enemies left. Come on. Yeah. Oh, three enemies defeated. All right. Go, oh, go. Found go. it. Do I even mess with it? Oh, it just escaped. Okay, whatever. Fuck you. Stop! 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 Two enemies. Right. You can attack before them. Soda. Counting on you. That's some thick skin. Two enemies. Charge through them. It's over. Uh oh. Yuki Chan's showing no mercy. Come on. Oh, nice. Damn, it's not going down. One enemy. Fight, fight, fight. I can't defeat it. Punt them. There we go. Punt them out of existence. Uh, I'll take the money. I'll take another key. Oh, you, Yuki is uh, a little low. Two enemy shadows. You get to go first. Mm, stupid ADT. Yeah, this Don't one. Don't use ice attack. Okay. Well, uh. Here, brush him down. Hang tight and go for it! <laughs> sensei! How dare you! Oh, Sensei's back on his feet! Chie <laughs> chan, don't go! Just up and left? Great work! What the fuck, Chie? Okay, bye. She back? Okay, she just left the battle. Okay, man, she a bitch for real. Don't, don't talk about her like that. What? There's the enemy. Smash it. Fuck are you? Counting on you. Ah! Damn, it's not going down. 
Easy. One oh, enemy! Fight! 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 fight. Oh, I can't defeat it! Come on! Yeah. How's that? Alright, well, um... Saw a new enemy. Got scared for, like, two seconds. Interactive gameplay right here, boys. Let's fucking go, Yuki. Something is on this floor, be careful. Like another shadow. Whoa. Two enemies! You uh scared to attack, but let's do it. Okay. Two enemies. Nah, I'm scared Try to attack, to but let's do it. Okay. Alright, cool. That's what I thought. I couldn't do it. in Sensei's way. It's over. There. So persistent. Come on. Yeah. Yikes, it's tough. One enemy. Fight, fight, Run fight. Out. How about that? Hey, yo, Yaz, can you, uh, Give me a favor real quick. Thanks, bro. Sure, why not? Who needs full health? Full SP. There he is! Kanji! My, my, thank you for your undivided attention. Mm, yes, I always give you my undivided attention. At last, I've penetrated the facility. These images are coming to you live from inside this steamy paradise. Mm -hmm. But I've yet to have any charming encounters. Could this hot fog be the cause? It's like steam rising from sweat. Mm, my body's tingling with excitement. You're not the only one, buddy. <laughs> Men only. This is so wrong in so many ways. I remember it. I'm sure you like feel it out like that. Show too. I'm I'm sure it feels very wrong to you. No, yes, okay. it wasn't like this. Those voices again. Wait, are they louder this time? 
these voices? I was wondering whose they could be since it's only the victim in here. Is it the people watching outside? You mean everybody who's watching the Midnight Channel? They're reacting to the show? Yikes! If people are watching Kanji-kun now, he's gonna be a legend in a way he never intended. Well, it's really his shadow, not him. But normal people won't know that. The shadows are getting really restless. That elusive thing I truly yearn for. Will I finally find it here? <laughs> well then, onward and deeper to reach further realms of romance. Let's get going, damn it! Kanji-kun! That was his other self. It's trying to reveal his hidden feelings. It seems much worse than that time with Yuki-chan's shadow. At this rate, it might end up getting bare naked. <laughs> Uh, welcome to the final episode of this playthrough. Uh, this is done. We're we're done. We're done. This is it. We're. I can't. I can't play anymore. I just can't. <sighs> Good God. Bear naked. Oh man, here it comes. Oh my gosh, no. Yoki. <laughs> Yukiko, you... <laughs> You're better than this. Please, don't. Um, was I supposed to laugh? Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind, this game is amazing. 10 out of 10. <laughs> oh my god. Hilarious. SMH my head, ma shaking my head, my head. Okay. I have a feeling there's other stuff this way. There it is. It's our turn first. There's three enemies. <laughs> Two enemies down! Wonderful, nice. Sensei! Throw down! Persona! Three enemies left! It's over! There! Two more to go! Punt out. Good job. Awesome. Chie Chan's in rampage mode. Ooh, that went well. Okay, follow me through doorways. It cannot. <laughs> All right, cool. Oh my God. There's five enemies. Now's your chance. This one's ice, right? It's weak to wind. Oh, it's Sounds wind. Easy. Okay. All right. Uh, I think I have. Oh, it's been so long since I've actually done this. I think Anzu has. I think it's Anzu. <laughs> Five enemies! Take them out one by one! Yeah, okay, cool. Go, Sensei! Well you done. knocked it down! You're awesome, Sensei! Right, go, go, go! Pretty rocky situation. Stop. You hit its weakness! Let me do it! Oh, yes! Hunt the boulder. Yeet it into space. Fuck yeah. Oh my god. There's no way I'm gonna... There's no way I can't... 
Uh, Now's our chance. You ready? Good answer. There's no way I can, you know, keep Chia away from my team now. Four enemies, you gotta hang in there. Persona. Oh, come on! There's no way I missed there. Are there. Two enemies. Hang in there. Uh, switch back to Jack Frost. Two enemies! Charge through them! That's some thick skin! Do it. Come on. Persona. Awesome. She ain't in rampage mode. Throw down. Persona. That's some thick skin. Just one enemy it's left. Yeah. Oh, I can't defeat it. Come on. <laughs> I did it! You did it, Sensei! Are you kidding me? Uh, I wish there was a way to sprint in this game. Two enemy uh, shadows! Okay. You get to go first! Throw down! Someone else's turn! Two Get's enemies down. left! Persistent. Come on! Persona! Chi Chan is swatting them left and right! Go down! Someone else's turn! Uchi! Persona. Just Persona. one enemy left! Oh, I can't defeat it! Alright. Punt him to oblivion. Fuck so yeah. Another level for me. Ah, oh, man. But I hang in there. Interactive Keep gameplay right you. here. How about that? How about that? I'm 
so skilled at the games. Do it. Chan is swatting them left and right. Uh, it got back up. Hurry and beat it. Uh, it got back up. Hurry and beat it. Chie Chan's all confused. Get crossed. You are trying your best to be funny, but oh my gosh, you're just spouting nonsense at this point. You love my jokes. Um, yeah, yeah, we'll go with that. It's our turn first. There's three enemies. Tiger with a bomb. Okay. There. So persistent. One enemy. Fight! Run fight! Out. Fight! Persona. It's not going down. Come on! Yeah. Yikes! It's tough. Pretty bomb ass tiger. <laughs> Tell me about it. <laughs> Rampage. Oh, Yuki Chan, that was lovely. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, I, I mean, defeat it. All right, let's keep going.
Ah, okay, so it's just a locked door. Okay, cool. Uh, move to the next floor, and then we say, see you for now. Man can't back down at a time like this. Just watch and I'll show you how manly Kanji Tatsumi can be. Okay, cool. Um, <laughs> all right, go ahead and stay there. Register. Oh. All right, let's see what we can fuse together. Fusion forecast. Uh, justice. Can I make any justice? I can not. Hmm. Archangel. So not worth it. I'm definitely making a bomb. I can make. No, I can't make Barrett. Alright, so. Effect bonus S Link SP and Miragi up added. Mm, not worth it. Um, I guess we'll just make some. The, oh gosh, there's there's three different ones at level 18 though. Alright. Uh, I don't. Mm, I want to be able to carry more. for healing. Wait, you need 20,000 yen for healing? Uh, hell no. Okay. 
Can I pat your head forever? Oh, okay, cool. Alright, let's continue on for now. Um, I'm probably gonna go until hit next level. First, there's three enemies. Persona. Throw down. That's some thick skin. Three enemies left. It's over. I couldn't do it. Go Jack Frost. I smell one enemy. You can do it. Hang tight and go for it. Back on his feet. Cool. Uh, all right, one in three chance. Okay, cool. Smell two enemies. Beat them up. Throw down. Persona. It's not going down. Persona. Yeah. I couldn't do it. Two enemies. Charge through them. <laughs> Good work, Sensei. That's one so far. Come on. Take it. Couldn't quite beat it. Chan, that was beautiful. Persona. Someone else's turn. It's over. So persistent. One enemy. Fight, fight, fight. Persona. Reverse nice.
One enemy! Now's your chance! Hang in there! Don't think. Feel. No. No. I don't wanna. I can gladly go through my life without trying to kill you. It's our turn first. There's three enemies. You can... Let me do it. Okay, okay. Punt the tiger into space. Let's go. Yuki-chan scared! I'll go for Maragi. Persona. Okay. Fighting through the fear to pawn him. So proud. Congratulations. There we go. That was perfect timing too, because that that was the entire level, wasn't it? It sure was. Okay. Move to the next floor. A man's 
Got this thing called pride. I'll never lose. This team's getting worse, so I can't tell where Kanjikun is at all. Maybe it's already time for me to retire from being a guide. You're doing fine, Teddy. You're doing fine. Yes, he's a teddy bear, that's why he's named Teddy. Yeah, huh? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm glad you figured it out. Well, I'll squish Teddy. Okay, go have fun. Dude, I love making an, apo an angry apostrophe. My favorite. I can make you. Oh. Just want to hold more personas at this point. in the center.
hard to do it. Hold on. Can I view by a level? Bring it down to Jack Frost. Oh, no. Okay. European descent normally an innocent creature, but if provoked, he will kill his victim by covering him in snow. Nice. Uh, not skill info. Um, That's the only one I'm making right now. Alright, alright, alright. Enough gay fit shit for the night. You're back. Much, but don't complain, okay? Dude, fuck yeah. Thank you, Detective Daddy. Hey. I don't consider myself an old man yet, but when it comes to high school, I don't know what to talk about. Can't communicate well with Dojima. If your expression was a little eloquent, you'd be able to carry on a conversation. Cool. I guess I'm going to bed. Finally time that we give goof she has some new shoes. It's very popular. Plus rage, low odds. Rage isn't good though. Plus one agility though. Some new kicks. Um, just abuse that. Oh, shit, that bastard sword, though. Master Sword or, or the Katana? I've been using a Katana this whole time. Let's go for a sword. Oh, 
shit. Uh, way better than what I have. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> what is this? Uh, just increases agility. Boo. Let's go to the roof, see if she is there. Oh, I cannot push Chia off the roof, not today. Nobody available? Ooh, I don't think anybody's available. Oh. Okay, well. Is there any new books? There is. Increase expression, boost understanding. Oh. Alright, I guess I'll eat some tofu. Uh, I, uh, steak bowl. Raise your understanding. Yeah, I'm thinking about going to bed soon too. I'm uh, had a long day of work today. First, I have to hang out with Nanako. Yeah. 
Alright. I'll go ahead and save then. Alright. Yep, I'll be in the stream for the night. Alright, good night. <laughs>